Hey guys, Fabrice Catra here. Today, we're working on our aerial ball first touch. So slightly different than the juggling progression, because here you're actually bringing the ball down on the ground. So a little more realistic to the game. And uh, this is our level one. So I used to do this when I played, actually, um, as a warm-up to just work on my first touch. So hopefully you guys have fun with it. Again, 10 exercises, one minute each. This is all about how to bring balls in the air and directionally where you want to go with it. Um, Cones are about five yards apart. You work one side, work the opposite one minute. Okay. So first one here, I'm gonna flick the ball over my head and I'm gonna bring it down with my laces. If you struggle with that, you could just literally go like this here and then bring it down with your laces. Uh, purpose of the over the head adds a degree of difficulty, adds a degree of awareness, body coordination, all that good stuff. it over, okay, flick it over my head, bring it down with my laces, okay, again, I'm going to flick it up, whoop up, and bring it down with my laces, good, bring it down with my laces, if you have a lot of space, I'm here in the Midwest, it's a little cold, may have to do things indoors, so I picked five, but if you have a little bit of space, you can make it a little longer to have some uh, more momentum. Okay, so that was laces. Next one here, it's gonna be with the sole of your foot. So you're gonna flick it up over your head, up, and then bring it down with the sole of your foot. So it's here. Notice I'm not stopping it, right? I know a lot of people are gonna to try to go like, stop it, no, you're just slightly touching it uh, as the ball bounces, and then it slightly goes forward as you put your sole of your foot on it. So, flick, up. Here, bam, and then you go. Okay, next one here, same thing. Now you're gonna bring it with your chest though. So, flick it up over your head, chest, and bring it down. Flick it up over your head, chest, bring it down. Flick it up over your head, chest, and bring it down. Do one more. Take that chest in a forward motion, and then you dribble with it. Next one here, same thing, you're gonna bring with your thigh now. So, I'm gonna flick it up over my head, flick it up, thigh, and bring it. Again, I'll do it again, flick it up, thigh, and bring it. Super important, I've noticed people when they do it, they'll try to like hit it with their thigh and it actually goes higher. <laughs> you're actually trying to absorb it. Okay, so notice my thigh comes down as that ball comes, and then I bring it down. Okay, now we're gonna go from series with our feet. Next one here, we're gonna face forward with it actually the whole time. Flick it up, inside foot, bring it across on the half volley. So check it out. Here, bring it across with the inside of your foot. Again, I'll flick it up, inside of my foot, bring it across. Right on the half volley, be patient, and then bring it across with the inside. Next one here, it's gonna be outside of the foot. It's gonna flick it up as it bounces outside. Okay? Get over the ball. Here. Oh, I'm a little rusty. It's okay. No retakes. So we'll flick it up here, outside. Notice there, too late in bringing it with the outside. It bopped up. So I really have to be right when that bounces, here. Really put your foot slightly angled above it to bring it across. So that was outside of the foot. Next one here is the cradle. You're gonna flick it up and you're gonna literally cradle the ball and bring it down with your inside leg. So watch here, flick it up, cradle the ball. Right here, flick it up, cradle the ball. Really take it directionally there, I kind of stopped it dead, but take it directionally with it. So bring it down and cradle the ball. Again, flick it up and then cradle the ball. Next one here, you've got the Cruyff. So you're gonna flick it up and then you're gonna Cruyff it right when it bounces. So check it out. As you flick it up, little Cruyff behind your standing foot. Flick it up here. 
Troy, behind your standing leg. Okay, so those were those were here. Make sure your knees bent and notice my plant foot hops a little bit. So as it bounces here, boom, oh, that was awful demo. It's okay. Good. So here, as it bounces, boom. Right when it bounces, do it. Last two. It's gonna be inside where you're gonna add a fake shot. So check it out. Flick it up, fake like you're gonna shoot, inside foot cut. Didn't mean to squeak there. Flick it up here, oh fuck. Ready? Flick it up, fake, bring it with the inside of your foot. Again, you're gonna flick it up, right when it bounces, fake. So notice my opposite arm is coming up, pretending like I'm shooting the ball. Just like the other ones on the ground, you can add a degree of disguise to it if you actually look forward with it. So as I flick it up, pretend yeah, and then you bring it in with the inside. Whew. Okay. Last but not least, outside of the foot. I don't know how long I'm gonna do this one, but we'll give it a shot. So again, fake like you're gonna shoot as that ball bounces. Whoop. Outside of the foot. So check it out here. Flick it up as it bounces, outside foot cut. Opposite arm comes up. Flick it up. Oh, fuck. Flick it up. Outside foot cut. Let's see if I can add a little look before I do it to add an element. Yeah. Outside. I'll do one more. Yeah. Outside. Woo! There you have it. Aerial ball, first touch, level one. 10 exercises, one minute. Have fun with it, work on your first touch. See you guys next time, thank you.